your secrets if you really look at yourself you would be speechless what happened to being doctors and teachers what happened to being your brother's keeper nowadays kids more worried about the reaper hello this is beta ray ben and welcome back to legend of zelda link to the past it's episode 16 it's turtle rock turtle rock yeah the the name escapes me How'd you like last week? Two episodes in one week? I bet you couldn't believe your fucking luck, could you? Come, come on. Now, I've taken a risk on this dungeon because it does strongly advise you to have a, uh, a magic potion before coming in here. I do not have one, but I think I should be okay based on no real uh, forethought luck or really anything. It took me some time to realise that you actually control the pad quite significantly in terms of direction. I'm making a huge error here. I keep uh Let's switch to fire rod. Right, now I need to hit these just right. Already messed up. Yeah. Messed up. Messed up. I got time. Now, there's a chance that top left one will go out before I make it back, but I've got one. I messed up. Okay, now I've really fucked up because some of them are going to go out, some of them aren't. I've definitely, yep. Shit. Right, this is a colossal cock up. Alright, need to. Ah, this is this has gone maddeningly bad, hasn't it? Okay, I'm better off. All right, they're all undone now. So if I, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go back up because I've realised you can't hit him all from the bottom row, and hit him from here in one nice little attack. I should have waited until I was on the return journey, but I think it should just last enough. I just gotta make sure I can get through that door. Come on. Come on. Come on. No! Right. So I have wasted almost all of my magic. That was very annoying. Need to make sure I'm on the on the return before I start lighting them up. I I won't be able to hit them as efficiently, but I will be at, I will actually make it to the fucking door. I remember this puzzle not being as simple as it seems at first. Right. Not yet. Not yet. I'm gonna hit these on the. No, I'm gonna hit them on the top side. In fact, make this the first one I light. Then you. Hope I've got enough. Oh, right. There we go. Perfect. I think I've got enough magic to do one more thing. So I better not waste it. This is a Super Mario style enemy. I feel. Unless this is magic, I... Oh, oh, not enough magic. Dungeon map. That's a good start. Little key. Also good. Main thing I remember about this dungeon is it is indeed very rocky. Um, as a theme. It's very cave-like. I don't think any of the other dungeons have actually had that. Uh, I'm just going to go back mentally. No, they do not. So when my greed comes back to haunt me, because I've already taken most of the uh, most of the goods. Shit! 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 Give me magic! Give me magic! Oh yes! This looks like a trap room. I don't get it. They're the only rooms that have tiles like that. If they really wanted to make them, you know, a surprise, put put rooms that have those tiles but don't have stuff like that. It'd make things much easier. I'll tell you, if you're watching this at time of release, um, I should have had a video out every day this week. Yeah. That was just because I got a kind of commission. And it was a really annoying one because they, they sent me some games to play and they gave me an incredibly strict time limit. That, like, the day they sent me the codes, they were like, you've got two weeks starting now. I was like, what? Never even seen these games before. Are you testing me? 
This is clearly a trap. One of these you can pull out. I'm, I'm sure of it. If not that one, it must be this one. Nope. Nothing there. There was a much easier way of figuring out if this was a trap. I could have just... If I actually look at the map, because I got the map, there is the connecting room, but I can't blow through, so... That was useless. It did gave me magic back, though. Alright. Alright. Just marvelling at this door. That's that's a brand new door design. I suppose it wouldn't make sense to have regular doors here, I don't know. That's probably an easier way of killing Hang on, hang on a second. I've got my I've got my silver arrows, I forgot about them. These are clearly chain chomps. They call them something different, but it's obvious what they are. What am I doing? I ain't got a key. Curious that, th that that switch is in the correct place. I'll remember that. The red one was down. Red down. Red down. Red is dead. If you see red, you're down. Okay. I'll now never forget that, and neither will you. You're welcome. believe that... Did we come in through that door? Use my handy map. No, we didn't. But I have seen everywhere now, so... Get a silver arrows ready. Something something attacks me in here, I'm sure of it. Nope. Ooh. Ooh. Compass. That's not good. I've already... Oh, yeah. Yeah, I remember that. Let's, let's use an arrow. Nope. Pointless. Always pointless. Yeah, that door. I think you have to moonwalk up to it, otherwise it won't open. So, I've been everywhere off of here. Let's go check out the middle. So I, f I feel like... What am I missing? There's no room I can't go in. I do need a key. Idiot. Idiot move, Ben. Now. I can't remember how it goes with this key, is it? Oh, I've got the compass now as well. So that, that means I can find out. Not that much, as it happens. Not that much. To get off this floor, I need a key. Get that key. I think I think it might just be. In no, I haven't got it. Just checking. It's somewhere. It's somewhere surprising. I'm sure of it. You don't. It's not. It's not. It's not that hard. But where? It's not this room. Because I've, I've seen everything this room has. No. trying to use the uh, control stick to control it. It doesn't feel right. It does not feel right. Oh, God. Where is this bastard key? It's funny. I'm, I'm actually recording this uh, in an evening. It's Saturday night. Because this, this is how I spend my time. Hang on. What's attacking? This room is... Uh, adjacent to the room with the snake heads. I'm actually going to leave and go back. Now, there is a chance because I know this. Th th that This dungeon has outdoors to it. As in, if I like, th these these entrances down here actually lead into the dungeon. Um, can't jump down so that's not it. See, uh, my knowledge of at this point is actually worse than useless because I know some stuff, but I don't know everything. If that's the magic one, I'm actually going to cheat. Eh? 
I've now got one more hit of magic than I than I could have had from that. So there's a little little bit of advice for you. I'm pretty sure I've got a got a bomb my way out. Give 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 me a little bit of a clue there. In that, well, it gave me a bomb. It's not a huge clue, mind. Notice how that heart can sit there, defying all logic. No, thought that might be it. No. Wait! The room with the chain chumps, of course, that's the key. I thought that might kill it in one. It did not. I should be using the uh, the ice rod and uh, the combo of that, really. Ice rod and hammer. That's it. Oh, I'm down to no health. Why did I think this would be the answer? Well, fuck me, it was. It's coming. Oh god, did you see the skills on that? As I said, my knowledge is somewhat helpful. I, I knew that there was something weird you had to do, and as soon as I decided to try it, I immediately got it right first time. Please give me a heart. Another one, please. Ah. Oh. See, it's easy for you, because I can just lower the audio on that noise, but for me, I have to deal with it. Oh god. Oh, cuts out when you go in here. Interesting. Interesting. That is worth noting. Worth noting indeed. Please give me health. Come on, just one. You bitch. Gonna start with the one on the right. You're gonna go through all of these at some point, but it's it's worth it's worth having some sort of system to it. Get the fuck away from me, you bastards. Damn it. Damn it. I was hoping that, uh, I don't know what you call them actually, those things you hit. Switches? I was hoping that switch would absorb the impact, but it didn't. Alright. Nope. They, they're a potent enemy here actually, because I just remembered, they, they kill your, uh, kill your magic as well. Cheeky shit. Throw an eyeball at you. You think you're safe, you're just running at the door. Boom, eyeball. Chest, what is it? Got the big key this soon. See, in my mind, the big key is like the halfway point of the dungeon. It's like, alright. Or, not, not quite halfway. Let's call it 40%, shall we? And after that, you get a. Uh, you know, you, you get the, the main item, and then it's like, okay, you're on the home stretch now. Go and. Go and finish this bad boy off. So when I said I'm going to take the right one first, I was very much the only one you could take. Of course, I've now got to go around again, take the one on the left in that lava-filled room, because God knows what else could be there. Very much like that. Not really, uh, not really any kind of puzzle or anything. Wait, did I just come out of this one? Am I that stupid? No. No, of course not. Son of a bitch. Oh. I need a weapon I can attack these with. I mean, I don't want to use anything that uses magic, because magic, you know, it's valuable here. Well, I shot the fuck out of the walls, that's for damn sure. Ah. Oh. No, I've just remembered what you use. Use the hook shot. Nope, you do not. Come here, you beanbag looking freak. Alright, pretty sure right is the correct way, so. 
think rats are going to attack me from here. I remember those weird rat things being a, a factor. Some of these eyes are not real. Some of them are. Yep, that one was real. I'm going to have to check how many, how many fairies I've got now, aren't I? I'm assuming I started with all four. I might only have two left. Okay, I've got two. Don't know why I thought that hammer would be good. This is my greed coming back to haunt me there. Always run. I think the mirror shield's in this room. Yep. Save a little bit of magic there as well. The size of this thing. Look at it! It's massive! It's not a mirror shield, it's a goddamn tower shield. My big key will get me through there. And that door's gonna shut. Yep. Enemies do not fuck about at this point. They will kill you very fast, apparently. I've got one fairy left. It's not really enough. I'm actually gonna just run. Just run out of there. Pretty sure. I need to catch that fairy. Okay, I'm about to get shot in this sight. Nope. Nothing I could do. What? Did you see that? It definitely pinged off that pot. I should have survived that fine. Oh yeah, this one just changes for no real reason. The other ones, they had a rule. They hit a block. Now I've got the sirens going again. Just, it gets me at all the wrong angles. Should be safe to get all these. Nothing? Are you kidding me? Just... drop anything? No, I guess I can't. You never know. Symmetry and all that. Give me a heart. You. Cheeky little slime. You. Heart. Nope. Alright, I'm starting to think that I cannot move these two squares. Ah, oh. right. Oh shit! I was actually hoping it would drop enemies. Then a couple of rats wouldn't have gone amiss there. Actually, a little bomb just to throw you off. Oh great! You can't, you can't use the boomerang on these, I don't think. Okay, I need to assess. Am I? Where is safe? I have to run out and run left to be anywhere safe. Right. Nope. This may work. Nope. Damn my greed. Why am I doing this? How many, how many fairies have I got? Have I got three now or two? Two. Not enough. Oh, God. Slightly changed the hitboxes on these, you may notice. They're ever so slightly harder to pick up. Ooh, 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 that was some... That was some exquisite dodging there. If I'd have planned that better, I'd be able to get out of here easier. Come on. Yes. Sweet baby Christ. 
Ah, oh, this is a very deadly room right here. You got a, you don't really have a lot of control over movement. You just got a kind of time and hope. I've made a mistake. I need to loop back. It should be safe. That's where I've got to go. So I need to get under there. I need to loop back again because I made another error. Because fuck. The only good thing is that did send me the right way. I'm now not certain this was the right way. Damn it. Okay, right, let's get down. Let's go across. Let's go ahead and equip this. Please. No. They're big on bombs in this dungeon, aren't they? Come on. No. Yes. Not quite enough to stop the annoying noise, but enough to prolong it even longer, so that's double torture. Okay, I've successfully gotten everything useless out of this room. I now need to get to the middle and get what I think is a, a button. I'm hoping there's no time limit on this. Yep, fuck that up. The worst part is, I can't remember how I did this to get it right. I just kind of did it by accident. Yeah, I got it. I got it. I got it. Just got to go left, left again, home free, and the door's going to close because it was on a time all along. Oh, no, it didn't. Just run. But obviously, don't run the whole way. There we go. See, the first one, that was all just a ruse. That was to get him to turn around. It's a calculated error. Impossible to really get out of that, unfortunately. You can't move backwards with your shield out, as far as I know. Just going to get a quick mental tally on this. I've got one fairy left. I think arrows may have an effect now. Yes. I reckon this leads back outside, or possibly to a fairy field cave. Or maybe both. Yep. See, the only good thing about that is there's now going to be things full of hearts. That was a bomb. You know, it's what they've done there. They've done that to annoy players like me, who have to have everything. Actually, no. No, 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 no. I know what it is. You do that, you walk back to the start. That's how you do it without losing all your life. Okay, we're going to test this theory. Walk back. I'm not going to kill him this time, because I've still got one more chest. Do it again. Walk back again. Absolutely leg it past everything. Bob's your uncle. Job's a good one. Can't say no to that many bombs, can I? Eight? That's like a baker's dozen. Please, please no one write in and say that a baker's dozen is... Isn't that many? It's, I know a baker's dozen is 13. I make 13 so that when one cake spoils, you you got a spare. It's yeah, it's nothing, nothing weird going on. Shit, 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 shit! It's organised. No! Hmm. Yeah, see, they've actually changed it. I'm pretty sure it used to be that if you were on top of one of these and you activate a switch, you can walk around freely. 
on top of those. But it's a good little trick you can use because sometimes they have really long lines of them. And it helps you. Uh... <gasps> if this is a heart, no. If this, ah, oh. ah, oh, ladies and gentlemen, let's just let's just briefly pause and remember what it was like to have proper hearing. Again, that's it's really only for me because I should imagine you're you're doing fine. Um, you have not got to worry about that noise. I of course will try and deal with it in the in the editing process, but but for me, Jesus, that was hellish. Those those few things. Ah, this is annoying now. It's uh, this is the, this is the end. This is this is the final boss. I'm fairly certain if I do something to one of those lanterns, I can get a fairy to come out. The only trouble is I can't for the life of me remember what it is. So best leave that, I think. Notice this gives you a hint at the enemy you will face. It's the three-headed beast. Oh, this is where you really need the magic, isn't it? Hey, I'm going to create a restore point. So if I, if I die fighting this, I will, just for, for sanity's sake, restore it. How many fairies have I got? One. Yeah, that'll do. Hey, bitch. Yeah. Go for the ice head first. Okay, now you can't pause it when this is happening. It's very annoying. I haven't actually got enough magic left to. Uh, yep, should have saved some of that. Really, just gonna. Yep, that's about as effective as I was thinking. Can't... Right, so at this point I've really just got to wait for uh, A, the sweet release of death or B, um, can they drop magic? I don't know that they can. So I may... So this is why I created the restore point. I'm not worried about dying, that's no issue. It's, it's being stuck in here. Yeah. Yeah, this is no good. Okay. <clears throat> and the worst part, of course, is... Yeah. Can't get out. I wonder if that will stay there successfully or not. It might, it might actually be the trick. I don't have proper spawn points, but you can... Do like a cheeky little one and have that there. So I'm gonna buy. Uh, I think one potion should do the trick. I'm gonna guess it's the blue one I want as it's the most expensive. Good. And uh, give me a little taste of red, will ya? Cheeky little bugger he is. He gives it gives you that to get you hooked. All right. I'm also. Gonna go home. Gonna restock on the old Fey Fey's. It's, uh, that's hip slang for fairies. Uh, obviously, I don't need to tell you that you're far cooler than I am. So I recently decided I'm gonna start doing something in these videos. I'm gonna start. Um, I'm gonna give like a little shout out to anyone who's made a comment on a video since I've made my last video. The only trouble with doing that is I do not release these in the order I record them. So, for example, I'm recording this Saturday night. It's going to come out on Friday. Videos that come out in the week may have been recorded before this, after this. I might have recorded it like four months ago and just held on to it for whatever reason. Like Receiver. I did that with Receiver. Taking a bit of a risk here. I haven't got any magic. Of course, I can't say the word magic for some reason. Yeah, so today's shout out is a list of one. The Reddish Samurai. He uh, made a comment on my uh, channel trailer. 
and I respect his advice because he works in radio. So uh, I'm not. I'm gonna give you a link to his channel if you want to find it. It's the Regis Samurai. So um, yeah, it's pretty good. I nearly got pushed off this rock just now. Ah, yeah. Can't get up there without. Did not think that through. Well, maybe, just maybe. What I'm trying to do is I need I need to get up there without getting in, into the dark world, and I might be able to do it from this angle. Right, here we are. I'm in a much better state than before. Did make the slight error of not. No, I'll be okay. So it's going to take about 80% of my magic bar to kill one head. And that's if I don't miss. Now, it is much harder to use the ice rod because it shoots slower. That is by far the best thing about this. The, the, the boss, he's not... His head doesn't go invincible at all. You can just shoot the fuck out of it. Alright, I missed. Oh, hello. I've just learnt that. If you... Uh, if you freeze it, you actually... Um, you can do damage. So I should definitely be able to do this now. Yep. Can't pause it. Now his shell breaks. You think, oh yes, I've beaten him. But then he turns into a giant flying snake that's far more powerful than his original form. Why did I think he could fly? Oh yeah, he can fly. But it kind of looks like he's flying. Do you think he's flying? I, I, I've always assumed he was flying. Like he's doing like a big sort of twisty fly around job. A bit like a kind of Chinese dragon. How easy was that, by the way? I, I, I didn't clock that in, but it had to be no more than like, what, 10 seconds? 11 tops? It's basically speedrunning territory. Oh, thank God. Well, we saved Zelda, so that's a plus. Only took us... 42 minutes. Wow. Well, wow. call it 40. Long one, that. This is going to take fucking forever to upload, isn't it? Bloody hell. Alright, what have you got to say? Hey, hey, Ben, Beta, let me just say, I appreciate your coming so far to rescue me. You appreciate. You, you're not. Fa you appreciate. That is literally the least you could be. As I thought, you're the legendary hero. I have felt this from the first time we met. D didn't we first met when I was saving you from a prison? If you met me before that and didn't tell me, you're a bitch. And if, if, you're, if you're claiming you have great wisdom because you knew that when you first met me, I was saving you. I'd already fought off like a, a flail-wielding... Ah. Yeah, he's waiting in his tower. Yeah. Once Ganon enters the light world, it is unlikely that anyone can stop him. But if he close, if he stays in the closed space of this world, you can find him wherever he runs. Now go to the Tower of Ganon. We will use our combined powers to break the barrier. Let's return peace to the country without fail. Do you understand? Yes. Yep, may the way of the hero, and so on and so forth. Right, well, I've been Beta Ray Ben. If you made it this far, thanks for watching. If, if you want to make it even farther with me, which sounds really creepy now that I've said it out loud, go ahead and hit subscribe. Uh, if you do, I will more than like it. No, it's not for subscribers, is it? If you do that, that's great. If you leave a comment, I will mention your name in the next video I make where I remember your name. I will write it down, so, you know, it will definitely happen. Trust me, it's it's brilliant hearing your own name getting said in the video. You, you feel like king of the world. That's why I always start by saying I'm Beta Ray Ben. So it's a little treat to myself when I edit and you know all that. Anyway, getting off topic. Subscribe if you want. Thanks for watching.